Hey you guys, so Halle Bailey takes accountability after overreacting over baby issues with her baby daddy on the internet. Who would have thought we would ever be discussing Halle Bailey daddy drama? But it is what it is, it's still 2024. <laughs> So you guys, before we get into this whole Halle Bailey baby daddy drama that played out a couple of hours ago, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to not miss out on more celebrity relationship gist. So apparently after the whole election issues and several people were in their feelings, some celebrating, some feeling sad, Halle Bailey interjected in the midst of all those emotions with her personal baby daddy drama issues and then she made a tweet that says hi everyone just so you know I am out of town and I don't approve of my baby being on a stream tonight. I wasn't told or notified and I'm extremely upset to have my baby in front of millions of people. I am his mother and protector and saddened that I wasn't notified, especially when I am out of town. You guys, when I saw this tweet on X, I was like, okay, what's going on? Because apparently I didn't even know that Halo, Halle and Diddy G's son was at Kai's stream. So apparently Halle and Diddy G's son was at Kai Sinet's live stream and she did not like it. I get it, y'all know Kai's stream can, you know, be filled with a bunch of people who give nasty comments, a lot of haters, but he was with his dad. And at first, when I saw this on the shade room, I was looking at the handle, is this really Halle? Because it wasn't giving Halle energy. Halle isn't known for bringing her personal issues to the ground. She isn't known to talk about her problems in the ground or even respond to issues to the ground. So at first I, I thought, okay, this must be some troll account. This must be, you know, some fake account or whatever. Apparently it was Halle. And again, I was like, okay, but this is his son. It's not like Halo has never been on the internet. His photos is literally one of the most popular memes that has gone viral literally since he was born his photos and images has been out there so i was like okay what's so special i do get the part of kai's stream but she felt like she wasn't notified oh yeah yeah that's tough yes good size good size chat good size then he got this right here oh, that's good that's good me. And of course, from the comment, you could see that a lot of people were not really feeling that. Some were like, okay, she's the mom, she's out of town, like she wants to be notified. And I'm just thinking, if you cannot trust your baby with a man, then you should not even have a baby with that man in the first place. Because if you're a busy mom, you're going to be traveling. The baby is going to be spending time with his dad at least. When you're going to go lay with a man, think about the fact that do I really want my kid to be like this person? Do I want to have a kid with this person? And if my kid grows up and has the characters and attributes and personality of this person, will I like it? Do I like the personality of this person? Can I trust my baby with this person? Those should be the question before you go lay down with a man and not even after you've had this kid with this man and you're like, oh, this, you should be able to trust his judgment trust that he will take care of your child, trust that he will protect your child from being exposed to dangerous environments and scenarios. Yeah, but well, some people were like, she is the mom, she needs to be notified, whatever is going on with her child, especially when she's out of town. I get that when you say notify, but if he has to notify you every damn thing and that child has to be with him for 24 hours, then your phone will be beeping every 24 hours and i get it she is experiencing pcos and if she has to receive beep 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 it's just gonna cause more trigger and anxiety if you ask me but yeah you guys the comments were not looking good like this person who said girl we told you you said we must mind our business and kalisa says girl that's his son he ain't gonna tell you s Another user say it's given he's not responding to her test, so we got added to the group chat. Like for real, let's be for real. I was like, Hallie brought this to the internet. Like, girl, this is not usually her personality. Another user say, girl, talk to your baby daddy, not us. Another user say, you know, it's bad if she's actually addressing it. 
Another user say love her, but the dads have just as much right as the mother unless court documents prove otherwise. This whole posting on the internet thing did not seem to favor Hallie. This user says, girl, you had a baby by a YouTuber. What did you expect? Another user say, it took two parents to produce that baby. Stop with the my child. You lay down with him. This is his child too. Stop controlling what he does during his time. Whoosh. Like you guys, you can see the comment for yourself. People had a lot to say and this whole backlash from the public was not favoring Hallie at all. And also to the fact that she also posted a baby, but I don't think she was complaining about the fact that the baby is being posted or it's online. It's just the fact that she wasn't notified where he was going to be. Of course, she doesn't know the people that will be at Kai's crib, you know, who they are, what they'll be doing. I get that, but, but she should trust the father of her child to know that he was going to protect his son wherever he is. DDG may not be loved so much by the public, but I think we can all agree that he's not a deadbeat father. We can all agree that he loves his son. He loves being a dad, even though it's giving sometimes he's exploiting this boy. He will put him out there on social media. He would, you know, it, it's giving that, but that's who he is. That's how he makes his money. And of course, even YouTubers who does family vlogs, they put their family, their kids, or we can say those people are exploiting their whole family for money. It's, it's just who DDG is. But I think we can agree he's definitely someone who will protect Halo from any form of harm. That's just my opinion, even though a lot of people may not like him for her and all the drama surrounding DDG, but I do not think he's a bad dad. She also trended with another tweet previous to the one she posted that says as a woman experiencing severe postpartum there are boundaries that i wish to be respected nobody knows what someone is going through until they snap you guys recall Hallie and ddg you know got separated after ddg announced it to the public in october and i don't know <laughs> i just can't help but to think is she also reacting to the separation because Hallie would never bring her, her personal issues with DDG online. But here are some of the comments after that tweet. This person says, the fact that you're all not understanding where she's coming from is very weird. Then another user says, the inexhaustible energy it takes to not understand the concept of her concerns is scary. She's simply saying a heads up would have been nice, as well as her equal consent to their child being at someone's home, being videotaped live to millions of people outside of their, the parents' personal platforms. The his with his daddy statement is undermining the shared autonomy and consent both parents deserve to give to each other about their children's whereabouts and who their children is around. It's not rocket science. Then again, many of you aren't that intelligible. DDG, without responding to any of those tweets, made a tweet thanking Kai for buying his son Halo a bunch of gifts after they were on his stream. On his tweet, he said, with gifts, Blackheart, me and Halo appreciate it, bro, at Kai Senat. After what Halle Bailey made a tweet saying she may have overreacted about her son being on Kai's live stream with his dad, DDG. In her tweet, she said, Yesterday, maybe I did overreact and shouldn't have brought it here. I know that Halo is always safe with his dad. I just don't like finding out with the rest of the world what my baby is doing. Thank you, Kai, for the gift for Halo. I think this was sweet because she was being honest and she was taking accountability. But some people on this street are like, is she really taking accountability or she's backtracking because it didn't go the way that she expected? <laughs> I don't know why they're saying that. Are they seeing this like the beta girlfriend or beta baby mama? But I feel like she was just being real. Like she's a new mom. She's never been a mom before. She would overreact sometimes. She would make mistakes sometimes. She would do it right sometimes. So I feel like we can cut her grace. And every day we learn. We learn what not to do. We learn what to do. We learn what not to bring on this internet. Because baby, these guys will chew you out. You would think they would be, you know, going in your direction. And one minute they are totally against you. However, these are what some of the folks on the street had to say. This is her first child. You overreact about everything with your first. Being a mom, I totally understand how she feels. She didn't mind him going with his dad. She just wanted to know before the rest of the world. I think it's not just her minding him. She didn't even know. So she didn't have the option to say, no, don't go with him. Or yes, go with him. That's just, she wanted um, to be notified, like she earlier said.
This user says he lost a good one. She admits when she's wrong. <laughs> Another person says it's okay, baby. Your mother who loves your child and, and DDD definitely should have informed you beforehand. Another user says finding out what your baby is doing along with the rest of the world is crazy though. Another user says he's a good dude. He didn't even respond to her though it probably really upset him at the time. <laughs> the comments to that say she directly tried to villainize him. This half-ass apology showed no remorse for trying to slander him, just covering her own tail. Another person said he didn't respond to her because she didn't directly send that to him. She said it to all people on the internet, lol. Another user said that's not an apology, that's a statement. Like, what's she apologizing for anyway? Whether it's a statement or not, it doesn't change the fact that she's taking accountability. Another person said neither one is in the wrong, just miscommunication. Internet who blow S out of proportion, SMH. Another user said, girl, wasn't no maybe. You did overreact, but thanks for the accountability. This user said SMH communication is key. Immature man, be careful who you have children with. You guys, you've heard it from the street and what people think about the whole Holly, Halo, DDG, baby, daddy issues and drama. But what are you thought? Do y'all think she took accountability or she's backtracking because of the response she got? from the internet well i wish Halle Bailey, ddg and of course their baby um light and love i know it's not easy you know having to become a baby mama and now he's no longer in her life he does a lot of cloud chasing she probably don't like it he was the first to talk about their separation even though she never speak on it up till now I just feel i just feel bad that all of this is happening to Halle. maybe we just look at Halle as this innocent girl all the time but well she's not just a young girl anymore she's an adult who is now a mom I, I pray she makes good decisions going forward and I, I just wish everybody would do fine but you guys what are your thoughts on the little drama that played out on the internet that Halle brought to the internet I believe after now she won't do anything like that again well you guys share your thoughts in the comment section as always, thank you so much for watching. If you got to this point of the video, do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video. And until the next one, remember to pray, walk out, walk smart, and slay. Bye-bye. <laughs>